My first aircraft I flew in was the Vickers Wellington. There was only six in the crew. And when the Lancasters came into production in 1942, we were issued with the, some of the first ones. And that was the aircraft I flew in after that. 92-year-old Bill Farnay recalling his time as a Lancaster bomber. In 149 Squadron, based at Mildenhall, Bill was just 20 when he flew the bomber. What was it like to fly it? Oh, it was a marvellous aircraft. Marvellous. Lovely. We had a good crew. Our skipper was a pre-war pilot. He could throw it, up, throw it about the sky like a spitfire. His flying career ended in 1943 and Bill was made an instructor. Two tours, that's 60 missions, in uh, November 1943. Then I was made an instructor on the East Coast. We used to go out over the wash in Anfield Hansons. Uh, teaching blokes how to use a, a gun. He finished his service in the Far East. He used to go all over the little islands making landing trips for aircraft in distress, you know. And we were on our way to Okinawa near the end of the war when we got word the Japanese had surrendered. So they turned the boat round and sent us to Hong Kong. No matter what your job was, we were around releasing all the Allied prisoners and rounding the Japanese up. Then I came home in June 1946. That was, that was the end of it. Bill is just one of 40 members from the Armed Forces Far East Veterans Association who gathered at Himley Hall Hotel over the weekend for their annual reunion. The Veterans Association was um, set up about 15 years ago. We're all uh, members of all the different armed forces, Army, Navy, Air Force or the Merchant Navy who all served out in the Far East up until the handover of Hong Kong in 1997. So we all served in Hong Kong, Singapore, Malaysia, Borneo, places like that. Newest member Reg Pierce from Wolverhampton served in the Royal Engineers between 1946 and 1953. We're all we're all ex-servicemen. We, I mean, we've got age groups from from sort of 50s uh, up until we, we've got Bill, who's 92, who was in the Second World War, um, and, it, and it's really good because we, we get together and, and, and we're all like-minded. Sedgley entertainer Kenny Craig entertained the veterans over the weekend.